guys, it's me again. So we have another one coming. So I don't know how long I have uh, time I have to finish this one. So what I'm doing, I'm gonna start here. But it start raining, I'm just gonna pull the car inside because you see that one up there? That one looks really bad. So I'm gonna take a risk. I'm not gonna pull anything. I I'm not gonna sit anything outside, like uh, my stand, the glass. Because if I have to run, I gotta run. So I'm gonna start working here and see how far I can go. This is the Miata. I'm gonna replace the windshield on this one. It's the Mazda. So it's, uh, it's almost the, not the new ones, but it's uh, still is on the new body stuff for the new Mazda. Remember the old ones, the square, the little one. So let me just start working on this one. We got the bad weather coming. I finished the Ford Focus, but this one I don't think so. I have to run to the shop. Up, 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 up. Come on. The sky looks bad. But I'm gonna start working here. If in case raining, I go in the shop. Okay, remember all the process is really simple. And I'm gonna start putting all my stuff inside. Because you have to run. Now remember these ones. And the old cars, we can. This is the security clips for the cow. Okay, these little ones. Some of those coming easy, even with your hands. In the past, we have the old Sentras, the 97 Sentras. They use, they love these systems to secure the cows. And here, <clears throat> let me get my. Let me get this little house right there. Right. And now we're gonna just take this one. Don't break it. This is easy to break those things. Uh, it's got a Phillips inside, but carefully because sometimes those things broke. They're broken in on this part right here. Just carefully. There you go. Because sometimes these things break. Um, you know, and it's gonna just you gotta put something to hold it. Okay. Let's fill it right there. Remember, that's why I pulled uh, the house because we gotta get two parts, but still you have this one attached, so remember that. This one is a cutie clip, so you can open it. It's like a little belt. Mm -hmm. Get this one in, there you go. Let's put it right there. I remember this one, I have to use, a, they give me GTN. No molding, so I have to put another one because this one is not good anymore. So I don't have time to run any line today. We go like it all school now. I make it cut and just leave the glass on if in case it starts raining. That's gonna give me some time to go in the shop. Because I don't want to be involved in pull the glass and rainfall. If I clean the bee, the bee is gonna stop a little bit the rain. So now I can get in the shop. <sighs> We got all the room we want. This is a little fun. 
Don't worry. You catch the parts you can. It's really old this glass. Part. You can feel the wind with the rain coming. Careful with the sharps, they can catch your glove and your hand really bad. Remember, I don't have battery and charger. I left in the shop. I have to come back. Okay, um, we finished this part. I think I have a time to ruin my bee here. I think it's gonna be finished the time. Oh, just one of these, guys. The rain, pulling is behind. People calling. Dealerships complaining. Ah, I'm not gonna pull it. It's a heavy, but it's gonna hold with this, okay? So I don't have time now. My time is bad. Okay, I got this part ready. So the only I have to do is vacuum those glasses and clean the bee. But I'm not gonna do it right now because I don't wanna get the problems with the rain. Start now. Just let me cut the middle of the glass. We have a time. Guys, no, I will take the risk. Like it because sometimes they hide chips, hits or cracks on the, under the tape. Let's see. <clears throat> <Thank you. clears throat> 
with the beta breeds it dries really bad on this part you see because I don't like it any problems I have my blower so I have to just go manual So now I'm gonna use our molding. Remember, I'm gonna use it's gonna be a Marcy M7. I like it, it's a little teeny. The problem you see the excess for the PVC is a problem sometimes with the molding. The only issues you could the PVC excess, you're gonna have on lamination later. Because that's gonna cover the itch. You cut them off, you leave the itch uh, alive. That's what I want to mean. Um, and the PVC with the time it starts to with like uh, water in the middle, uh, or, or you know, or something we call the flower, it's gonna come like a little flower. That one is for lamination glass, so that's gonna happen when you cut the itch. The problem is, sometimes you have to, but if you're gonna cut it, like this one is not too big, but it's you not know, pushing my molding too much out. But if that's happening, I have to just cut them off and use the primer and prime the itch, and that's gonna seal it, the itch of the glass. So, because on lamination glass is another problem when you cut the excess of the PVC. So don't cut it if it's not really make any problem but if it's too big you have to cut it and just prime it the edge would you prime it you know this regular primer just prime the edge and you're done uh, all right so, uh, so we have a good time I think rain gonna be the rain but maybe not you see you can feel it 
I gotta run to the shop. But I don't have because it's too short, it's too small over there. Okay, so I got this part ready. Let me get the glue ready. I can just take the glass out, clean the bead. This is for my other job last before and the four focus. So I'm gonna this part. Man, that vein is here almost. I can feel it. Already here. So it's gonna start raining. We're going inside the shop now. I'm gonna take the windshield. I have some time, still have some time. Alright, but just put it right here. It's no time. Sorry about it, but it's raining here. I feel nervous. <laughs> That's when the mistakes can happen. Kids, trashes, broken windshields, when we roast like this. <sighs> Come on, boy. You can make it. today so I don't want to prime it a lamination a lamination I hate the lamination therefore with your bit number this is like a sticker That vein is gonna be hit me. right here okay that one is bad okay down right here and that one Okay, a little primer. You see it's sunny, dark, crazy weather. Come on, come on, just shake down, shake down. Today I'm just going to wet a little bit on the primer. I don't have too much time. I'm going to hit the rain. Um, that's it. A little suspicious here.
I cut in the edge, just the glue, because I want to just pull it up like this. Alright. Okay, guys. Let's see. No more time. You see those points? You follow. It's the glue. That's it guys, no more time. I'm gonna have rain any minutes, any second, so. I don't like when you guys watch me. <coughs> Little nervous, but with this sky, it's difficult work. You see, I got little drops right already. Come on, come on. This one you can go on the top, okay? The wind is moving my glass. Fast, so I'm gonna make a test leak detectors. I want to make sure nothing, no problems. This car. Yeah, you see, I got water already here. Ah oh, man, I finished just in time. There you go. Let me just seal it. You see the molding looks very nice. Pushing down because the rain is coming. And no matter if it's gonna rain, it's nothing is gonna happen. The glue is gonna keep the water out. So don't worry. But you gotta make it sure it's tight. There you go. Now, you wanna rain? Just rain, I don't care. Ugh. Okay guys, so I just had to put all parts together. You see how the weather is? So I gotta just put all the parts together, we finish, you know the process to pull it up and you know how to go back there. So see you in the next video if we can because raining is here. See you next guys. Hey guys, I think we have some time. I think the rain is not falling yet. So I have time to put all parts together. Remember I have to continue and record it because this is on my files for my record so I have to just keep it. But I think we did not good. I don't see any problem, I even my leak detector so everything is you know fine it's no big problem nothing is messed with the glue so we're good all right guys so let's start putting all parts together but if you want to skip this part you can do it you already saw the process so <clears throat> there you go we're like the hose right here Like a, like a clips, like a hooks on the bottom. with the bar. Okay, one is in.
Little pin. Is a little hook? There you go. Alright. There you got that right there to show you where to go. screws on the corners because many guys when they do this once they don't pull nothing here they only just pull the wipers and they stick the glass in the hole and it's not good and it's a fast technique if you want to go out faster but it's gonna make you problems with the seal later Okay, I think we'll beat the rain one more time. Let's see what happens when the next one. If I'm lucky, or no more. Well guys, I think we're finishing this part. If you want to keep the video, it's fine. I want to just keep this core recording because that's one of my files. So you can skip this part already. <clears throat> okay. Section caps are. Remember, I don't use any tape. I don't need to use any tape. I trust in my job now, and the glue and all in the tapes. People trust more in the tapes than the glue, than, than the job, or the glue, or something else. Remember, when you attach the glue, that's gonna hold the glass. It's not gonna move anymore. So you don't have to use nothing else. All right. So let's see. I'm just gonna put this one. Now it's time to take this one off. It's a little tight, small, the roof. Okay. What? This one is going to be harder. You got to go through the hole right there. And stick it there. Okay guys, so we finish. I think we beat the rain. The sky already passed. Let me see what I step on. Oh, just a little box. Okay guys, so we finish. So you see the molding is nice, there's no problems. Up, oh, this one pop. There you go. Okay, so we finish. So the molding is nice. Is the remember this Marcy? Is the M7, so we finish good. So See you the next job guys, I think we can do more because the rain is here almost, so see you the next one.